Hello everyone. This is a recent build of a Windows 2000. Uh, I'm sorry, Windows 10. Um, went from Windows 7 to Windows 10. It did an upgrade. Everything was working fine, and then all of a sudden, uh, what I saw was that my memory, although I have 12 gigs of RAM installed, went from 12 gigs of RAM. Uh, all of it was consumed. So this was full utilization of 12 gigs at 96%, 97%, 94%. Uh, it was constantly being used. Along with that, I was seeing that my disk was also constantly being at, at the higher level. And there were no apps running. Nothing was running. No Chrome, no nothing fancy, no um, Vegas Pro, which is what I use, no games, zero. No apps were running. And despite that, my memory was pegged at 96% and my, and my disk was pegged at a higher percent. I did a search on the internet, most of them spoke about some kind of a memory leak, check your drivers, so I went through, you know, device manager, um, let's see, I gotta right click, I went through my device manager, and I, um, and I brought up things like, you know, looked at my video card, see if, you know, maybe my video display drivers were, were, um, where I have an older one and there's a memory leak, look into that. Um, I got a display driver. Um, you know, see if you can update it. Uh, they were all fine. They also spoke about my network card requiring maybe a memory leak. So I went into my network card and I did, you know, update driver. That one was perfect. Um, also told me go into my registry and um, you know, change some value of, uh, of my network driver from 2 to 4. I did that as well. None of this worked. I uninstalled Chrome because I thought it was a 32-bit. Uh, I have to reinstall. I installed Chrome. I uninstalled a bunch of other software that I wasn't even using just to be on the safe side. I also went in here into services and Microsoft has a search um, Uh, that's a window search, sorry. So that's what it was. It was window search, uh, which is right, windows search right here. And I was told, hey, why don't you, why don't you, you know, disable window search? I disabled it, still no improvement. Then there was another one that started with an S, I forgot what it was called. Um, let's see. Secure sensor, which was disabled, Skype. I also uninstalled Skype, that didn't help. Um, Superfetch. I also disabled this thing called Superfetch, and that did not help either. And believe it or not, after doing all this, what finally helped was changing the, f the page file size. So I should have realized that from the very beginning when I saw that both the memory and the disk are correlated. Uh, basically, the page file sits on disk and the memory offloads things to disk. And if the page file is small, it also does a lot of paging, and also everything it, it keeps in memory for whatever reason. So what needs to happen here is to change the, the page file. Um, and I will show you how to do that. And you basically, you left click, I'm sorry, you left click here, and you go into system, I know this is too bright to see. Okay, and then here's here's my here's my system. And nope, well, I have 12 gigs of RAM, 64-bit Windows 10, blah blah blah. I have 12 gigs, 12 gigs of RAM installed. And you go into this over here where it says Advanced Settings. Um, and under advanced, you want to go into um, you want to go into uh, here visual effects, processing, scheduling, memory, usage, and virtual memory. And you click on settings, and here you go into advanced. Also, so here um, the virtual memory we you want to click on change. Okay. So what was set by default by Windows was this automatically manage paging file size for all drives. And this was set by default. And then uh, down here, this was checked, I believe, system manage size. 
I uncheck this and for C drive I went over here for so for 12 gigabytes and you multiply it by 1024 because memory is in the power of 10 uh, I'm sorry memory is in the power of um, uh, in base uh, base 2 so it'd be 2 to the 10th power that's 1024 so 12 times 1024 is 12,288 and then the maximum size is doubling that which is 24,576 I did that click on set clicked on OK it asks you to restart and after I did the restart lo and behold my memory went down to this 2 gigabytes of usage and also my disk activity is down it only goes up once in a while before it was constantly going up and down this dramatically increases system performance um, uh, so I just went through all the scenarios that I did uh, to get to uh, you know uh, a very good output so maybe you want to try this first maybe you want to change the uh, virtual memory which is the um, the page file size and see if that helps before you start uninstalling things like like I did so I uh, hope this helped your uh, video I mean I hope this helps you if you have this problem with Windows 10 or even Windows 8 rather of excessive memory and disk usage when nothing is running um, so uh, let me know if it helps let me know if it doesn't help um, and please subscribe and if it helps you give me a thumbs up thank you very much